one, go. Kicking off this match, we got two blue robots looking to score a high. Got two scores low for red, one high for red. 3940 looking for a dock. Conductor's also doing that. Sorry, let's make that an engage. That's going to be the conductor with an engage, or a dock, the Cybertooth with an engage. Team's now working to collect in the middle of the field. Red Alliance choosing to put out cubes since that's their main specialty. Blue Alliance choosing cones as they'll be able to grab those off the floor easier. There's also more high point value places for those cones. Hundred and fifteen seconds less than this match. Thirty-five to twenty-eight. Once these game pieces in the center field have been completely cleared, robots will start looking for game pieces across the field. 39 and 40 sniping one of the original auto pieces that was for the Red Alliance. Helping them continue that lead, 52 to 34. Now robots are going to have to make full field cycles. 940 collecting a game piece high. Red Alliance, we're in grabbing the Danville machine able to collect a cube within their robot. Breaking away, giving their alliance partners a little bit of time to get through. Successful link finish by the conductors. 66 seconds left in this match. Red Alliance with three robots having to skillfully avoid colliding with each other. Blue Alliance, well, down a robot does have the advantage of not having to worry about clogging up the two main areas in the loading station. 66 to 45 in favor of your Blue Alliance. Blue Alliance will need to gain some points here, though, because they can only balance two robots at the end of their match. Another game piece scored high for the Blue Alliance. With three game pieces scored for both alliances in the center, that means that the rank point for Lynx has been reduced down to only four. With 15 seconds left in this match, Blue Alliance choosing to get the balance and get the rank point from that instead. Red Alliance looking for a triple engage. They do so. Let's hear some noise for these teams. Blue Alliance winning at 98 to 72. That's going to drop Cybertooth down to the second rank seed. They only were able to collect a three ranking points in that match. They'll also drop Danville 4485 into the eighth rank seed. Congratulations to the Blue Alliance for winning a Qualls match 13 here at the Finn District Greenwood event. And with that, we're going to go on a quick lunch break.